the site tomorrow. And there was a candle lighting ceremony in Utrecht tonight. Local residents came out to show support for the Hasidic Jewish community. And Angela, it's a reaction to the borough's ban on new places of worship. Paul, you may remember that Utrema held a referendum on religious accommodation just two weeks ago, and residents voted in favor of upholding a ban on new places of worship on Bernard Avenue. Now, this is something that directly affects the borough's Hasidic community by blocking new synagogues from opening. So tonight, people in Utrema who were against the ban came out to St. Vieter Park. They came to show their support for their Hasidic neighbors. Everyone lit a candle, and they say it was all in the spirit of celebrating diversity and building bridges between communities. Now, citizens for an inclusive Utrema, as well as friends of Hutchinson, were all involved in organizing the night. It was the first gathering of this nature in the borough that included both Hasidic Jews and members of the broader community. Have a listen to one of the event's organizers. People are very happy to be here and to meet one another, and there's uh, equal representation from the Hasidic community and uh, the broader community in Utrema, and people have even come from outside of Utrema to show their solidarity and stand up because it's a human rights issue, ultimately. And Paul, the Hasidic community may end up contesting the bylaw in court. They say it's unconstitutional. But in the meantime, Schiller says they may hold more friendly ceremonies like this one in the coming weeks. All right, thank you very much, Angela.